Welcome back to Washington. Uh, Morose. Morose Intrepidus. Let's get him. Oh, uh, we need to finish the Aloro. Yeah, finish the Aloro with a little bit of Morose on top for seasoning. Um, maybe you to do it faster. Plus, then we don't have to rest this guy soon. And we'll get the Aloro. Honestly, with the Aloro and the Morose, we might be close to done. Um... I mean, we gotta keep digging here anyway. But, uh, yeah, we're getting down there. I might keep you around. Send these two? Sure. Why not? Is this the final episode? It could be. 4.5 stars. That could either be super easy or a complete ball egg. Hard to say. Well, we'll be back in a minute to hatch some Aloros. Let's get Aloro Titan. See what we get on random and then do. Okay, we'll do we'll do 100% humble, 75 social. I suppose the real thing here for like getting this done is if stuff starts dying or not. We shouldn't need that many Aloros. I'm not gonna, that's a small pen. We're not gonna push that very hard. Um, yeah, I was gonna check our time. That's what I was thinking. Oh, uh, up here. So we're coming up on hour four. Our time's eight hours. We should have this done under five, I would think. Um, these fossils are already done. You're a liar. Wait, are you a liar? No, you're not. Just kidding, these are new. Fish. Restarsons. Yep, that's the, what that word was. That's absolutely what that word was. So, Morose is not quite done. Fuck it. More! Actually, is there a second dig site for Morose? I would assume there's not when it's down to single digits. I also think Morose is a unique specimen. It's a fairly new dinosaur, and I'm pretty sure it's one partial skeleton that it's named from, not like multiple. Okay. It's fun that they put Intelligent on this map. It, it comes into play like very little. Unless you were Intelligent. No, you're, you're just a big dummy. You're just a big dumb Albertosaurus. You're not intelligent at all, you stupid ass. Look at your dumb eyebrows. No, nah, Albertosaurus is fine. It's not his fault he's stupid. Five eggs, we'll hatch five. That should be perfectly fine. Uh, just kidding. We need we need our um, other dude back, I guess. What did I send him out on? What is he doing? Wait, why is my welfare guy not here? Uh... Fossil extraction, fossil extraction. Yeah, that's true. I did do that. All right. Very well. We could probably slap down another staff center. Um, I'm sure that's a thing we have. It is. Probably not down here. This is much more limited space. Whereas if we go all the way up the hill, oh the way up the hill we got all this space back here that's not in use um or like this actually yeah it should just be like over here really because there's like nothing else that goes in here like nobody's doing nothing in this section of the park um No. No. Sure. Research hatchery cheaper genetics. That's probably expensive. Probably should have done a research contract if we're being honest. 500k. I mean, so we never do this, but it's probably 
Actually, I'm curious what the rebate on cheaper genetics is. I've never bothered to use it. Okay, fine. Yeah, that doesn't even pay for it. But uh, we'll, we'll do it. We'll find out what the deal is there. I'm, I'm, I'm content for that. Um, let's get these fossils going, of course, though. It's the, or the, not the fossils. These are living dinosaurs. Um. Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The fossils came in. The extraction's still ongoing. I was deeply confused. Yeah, so that was this bit. Oh, I could have let them have these. That was just trash. We just have to go out and dig up another morose. Here's an objective like. you should definitely take a moment to review. Give me it. Okay. The team's interested in this particular item, and we can help them with the research. Or to begin. You can rest, and then if we go to research. That's nine, four, four, and one. Sure, why not? Brew it. Do it. And then we can actually get the cheaper genetics in there for the morose and see. We can play around. Yeah, we'll actually check out what the difference is. We'll actually like do a before and after comparison. Um, so we'll finish that in a minute, and then we'll have a bunch of people have to rest. They'll be back, and then, yeah, when the eggs are hatched, we'll figure all that else out. All that else out? We'll figure out all of that. We'll figure out everything else. One of those things is, is correct. So this is the upgrade. It's $300,000 for a 20% cost reduction. So $800,000 investment plus... A little bit for the fact that you'll have to rest the scientists eventually because of the pip of work on their meter. Um, okay, so the Aloros are done. Let's get them out. Release a via airlift. Ground fiber. Fiber is trike, unless I fucked up, which is possible. No, I'm pretty sure that's fiber. Looks like fiber to me. One, two, three, three, three. Four, five. Okay. Fiber. Yes. Excellent. Tentras are fighting for dominance. Are you fuckers getting old? They might have separated. 65, 85. That's, that might be getting into old age where they start to lose dominance or whatever. Oh, shit. Uh, Ranger Team 2, yes, if you wouldn't mind, please administer to the Carnicores. Yeah, he's a rolling out. Oh, he's got to go through... Oh, shit. The galleys are dying of old age. Uh, unexpected. I mean, it probably makes sense that they're the first thing to fucking go, but that's not the best. All right, let's get a gate in here for the so the jeep in the future doesn't have to go all the way outside like that. Um, yeah, put it there. Okay. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Dinosaurs are actually dying. We might be here for a little while longer than I was hoping. Um, did we finish the morose genome? No. Wait, because I was processing fossils, but we didn't process the new batch that came in. Unfortunate. Okay. We'll do these two. She'll chill. We'll rest the other three people here. And then we'll have her available to do at least one batch of morose. Actually, what's the cost? Five. Yeah. Okay. Fine, that's how that's going to play. And then I think we'll pivot over to Gallimimus and finish up that genome so we can breed new galleys. We can breed them with Humble and Social and then we should be able to like introduce more than seven into the park. I think they had a little bit of leeway anyway. It should be fine. 
We'll worry about that after we get the morose out, I guess. I mean, we're at 4.7 stars, as is. Like, it's close. Uh, we do need to check on the Aloros. So we can use this hack to send us all the way across the map for free. Okay, there's the Aloro. Fiber and forest needs not yet met. Look at that Aloro. You're very bright. Amazon Plukarana. Number two, just arriving. The opposite of that one. I mean, the striping and the crest are still pretty detailed, so. So... Social animation for the Aloro there. I like their hands and feet. I like the the colorization they get there. That's kind of a neat vibe. Confirming asset delivery. I wonder if they're gonna be happy. I mean, that looks like they should be fine. You are what? Mangrove Pucarana. Purple. That's a nice shade of purple. I like that. De oh my god, three corpses. Death Valley Lethal Baits? Okay, let's pause. I also like the striping on their tail. Like a, like a good lizard vibe on that. Alright, number five. Okay, who died? All of the Gallimimuses in the world are rapidly becoming corpses. I, okay. Comfort 71% lonely. Yeah. Asset transportation Okay, Loros are good to go. Five is all we're putting in them. That's, uh, that's enough. Amazon lethal baits. Sure. It's fine. Do the contract. Growing family. That's a no for me, dog. Revenue or ticket sales? We'll do revenue. Okay, uh, how many galleys are left? Like three. They have a little target icon on them, which I hope is not significant. I mean, I'm assuming it's just signifying that they were once wild dinosaurs. Um, but hopefully there's not like a penalty if they all fucking die on me. Oh, we need more ground leaf. Shit. Sneak a little bit in here and there, here and there, here and there. Another objective has just landed. How's our else doing? Rocky's 100%, Para's 100%. I've the details Everything's with fine. You. Everything's fine. Comfort 99. You fuck asses. Hope they're good. They're good. Everything's good. Everything's good. Don't worry about it. Okay. 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 All of our people are back. Everybody's home. Everybody's here. Um, okay. So morose. Random, random. Maybe not that. Sure. Okay. So 25 plus 5. So tw no, it's just 25. Plus 5 from the thing. And then if we toss in the upgrade. For 300k. 20. Yeah. So it shaved off 5k? Wait. It shaved off the full cost of the genetics. Right. Because it's the total synthesis and incubation cost, not the amount of genetics put in. That's a highly relevant, actually. So this is actually pretty good. Because it's not the amount added, it's the total cost. Yeah, that actually saves a lot of money. Should we be using that more often, I wonder? Early? Push that pretty early or not? I mean, in this one with all the wild dinosaurs, it probably didn't matter that much. But I feel like in some of these, it might be a pretty big grab. I don't know why I couldn't click back to the hatchery there at first. Um, all right. Morose. Synth fat size is three to six. These are solitary, I think. We might be able to just do one wave in the big pen here and it'll be fine. Um, I'm not going to use the six genetics either. 
Let's just uh, let's just keep her around for like gamma minuses, which we're gonna do too. So let's restock the galleys, which is also the Ovi Raptor dig site. So I mean that's fine. We're doing Ovi Raptor too now. Shit. Perfect. Okay, good. I don't want to do the welfare guy there because we probably need him to hatch. So this is fantastic that we can get him to five. All right, four hours out of eight. Halfway there on the par time. Uh, we should check our visibility here. Yeah, so those tours on the return trip don't see shit. But those ones are far away. Maybe we should move those ones closer. I mean, this arc should get seen. Mm. The Alberto is seen. I guess we'll let's keep an eye on it as it passes through here. Yeah, so they don't catch the lake. They missed one of the Carnos. That's not that bad. It's not good. But it it's fine. We'll make do. We only need some of them in view. I mean, how much appeal are these guys anyway? 361. Plus the intelligent. Okay. Oh, revenue good contract. Job. Nice. Let's keep our heads we got the bump from them seeing like them there. Asset transportation in um, hold on. Synthesize, morose, social. Yeah, min pop one. So we do one clutch of morose and that's enough. Humble, social, humble, aggressive. Um, I might not want aggressive. I don't know if it matters because they're little dudes. But they're also not worth much anyway. Oh. Dominance 55%. Dominance forty five percent. We don't hatch the aggressive because it fucks up the uh, the social. Um, all right, there we go. There's the met formation. Okay, we've got a variety of ov, not enough galley, so we're gonna go back out again. Fine. Not a problem. Two minutes. Uh, let's make sure the galley is not going to start kicking the fence up here. Comfort 63%. Well, it will hold for now. Okay. Let's get our little chickens out here. Adorable little shits. Hop, hop, hop. They're going to need a meat feeder. We'll probably slap down like three of these in different areas. Maybe we'll put one over here. We'll put one by the water, kind of, maybe. And then maybe one in this section. About like that. 100%, 100%. 99 on Brocky. Okay, what did you lose? You lost some Talma. Where can we get some Talma for you? Um, there you go. You're done. Okay, next. What else do you guys need? Missing meat and sand. So that's easy. We just grab the sand brush. And we just follow the tour track and sand the tour track. That gives uh, an aesthetic that looks reasonable. And meets the sand need. Let's let them move around here while we do this. There's no reason not to do that. 
Sand, 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 more sand, sand, and sand. Great. Yeah. So you got like just a sandy little trail through the woods. That's that's a thing. That can that can work. All right, Moros. We got Moros 2022. We got Svalbard Pool Karana. Sure. We've got 2022. We've got Amazon Paparana. I can see the blue and green. Yeah, that one's that one's distinctive at least. Yukon Pilo. Yeah, the black one. Yukon's a pretty good color for these guys. The Pilo on the face don't really do it for me, but the rest of it's fine. Um, open space, sand, water, area. I haven't found the meat feeder yet. Like, it's right there, dudes. It's right there. Uh, another dead galley. Sure. I'm sorry, did I grab that? No. No, I did not. There we go. Uh, fossils. Give me that gal minus. Uh, is Over Raptor in two dig sites? It must be. It has to be, right? It's got its own dig site at Mongolia, the, the Jadokta Formation, Jadokta. I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I don't know, Chip. All right, let's work on more Ovi Raptor. Uh, the last Gallimimus is very angry. Honestly, at this point, we could probably, well, let's just sedate it and leave it there. It'll probably die. I just need him to not hit the fences. Yeah. Even I could do this next job, which means you should be able to as well. Read up on the details of the objective and okay. then chop chop. Um. Chop or chop chop. <laughs> Get it? Huh? They just need to move around, man. They need to not hang out in this damn corner. You're in the paleo curation business, sure. But people only hear that paleo <clears throat> part. However, it's that second business part that's really at our core. They're close, the except for water, of, of course. Fittest, hmm? um, we might want to be more thorough on the sand. Just, like, retrace this path again. Just to make sure we're getting enough. They need more open space than they do need sand, so I mean, like, it shouldn't be an issue. Like, if one should meet the other, it should just work out, but... You're making tremendous strides. This last objective okay. being a perfect example. And I suspect you're gaining interest from the higher-ups. Uh, just remember who's in charge, huh? huh? And if you do remember, <laughs> can you share it with me? Random, random, give me humble, humble. Social, social, humble. Save and exit. A sign. That was a five? Let's use you up finally. 20 seconds there. Yeah, they're actually aggro right now, which is stupid. Really? Because you don't have water? You fuckwits. That's actually really, really obnoxious. They're that fucking bad. That's surviving. Alright, there there's some water. 93%. Yeah, so you get uh, like a huge penalty if they don't have any water. Which is a bit rubbish. Uh, you are suddenly missing tons of ground leaf. God damn it, guys. Okay. I was really worried it was going to be a cohab thing. Danger to vehicles. Seriously? A Draco Rex? Are you fucking joking? 
How is a Dracorex a danger to a goddamn vehicle? Tall nut missing. Missing! Tall nut forest is okay. Do some in here then. Okay, uh, check everything else. Dracos, 100%. Paras, 100%. Morose, doing morose things. 81, 88. Missing meat? How are you missing meat? Because your territory doesn't count? Like, what the fuck? Stop it. Stop it, Carnotaurs. I mean, I know the Carnotaurs are going to, like, attack Jeeps. Okay, um, uh, where are we at? Galleys are doing a thing. 10 Gallimidas eggs. 1, 2, 3. Skittish large appetite. Yeah, these, these are all fine. They're just galleys. They're not going to be. They're not going to be uppity. We'll grab you. They're done. We just have to do two clutches. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, then the last dinosaur I want for the park is probably the Iguanodon. So let's start the Iguanodon. Probably four. Great. All right. Well, there all that goes. So the Iguanodon goes with the Stegos, and then the Ovis, I guess, maybe go with the, try them out with the Carnotaurs or the Albertosaur. I guess. See if they get startled like the Moros were with the Giga. Um, ratings are still good, so this is just appeal, still. Alright, three minutes, one minute, one minute, 30 seconds. Um, yeah, I'll, the galley's gotta fly all the way up the hill, so we'll pause here for a bit. Alright, wave of iguanodon fossils has come in. Where's my... yeah, over your after. Finishes that. Alright. Um, let's get you used up. We'll rest you. Expedition for more Iguanodon. Five and a four. That's locked behind drought tolerance, which is not very good. We probably won't do that last set of skins if we're being honest. Uh, the galleys are flying in now. The morose are being little shit. They've fragmented into like three packs, which is ostensibly not an issue because there's like should be space, but they end up missing water and feeders because they separate out and then they forget the their territory. And, park struggle in the testing condition. And that's just uh, a bit rubbish. Okay, these guys, yeah, these morose. Okay, they're actually good. I was going to say, maybe we need more sand or something. Damage shelters, fuck's sake. Our scientists are, like, super close to exhaust anyway. So that's fine. More the merrier. Um, no. Park appeal, why not? Okay, so, uh, this group over here, 89. Oh, they're actually good. Okay, I mean, so enough of them have reformed territories that it's workable. You're starving. Bro, trust there's is me. A big part of the job. find it. That's why I trust you'll take on... Okay, uh, galleys. Galleys, galleys, galleys. This latest objective and see it through. I mean, they should be fine. Security is about attention to detail, Oops. something you clearly understand. We can wake up the one... Did it die? Did it wake up on its own? Oh, I don't know. Asset has been transported. Yeah, Gallimimus 1 woke up. Hey, he gets to meet friends before he dies. He gets to meet the next generation. That's cute. Galley 8. Fill in blank. Blue. Boring. Blue. Uh, Yukon Lethabates, eh. Mangrove Pucarana, a red and white Gallimimus, not, not bad. Gallimimus tends to not win many awards in terms of, uh, aesthetics, unfortunately. Which sucks, because I like the Gallimimus in Jurassic Park. Yeah, that one's not doing much for me either. It's not 
an awful green galley. Some of them aren't landed yet. So, whoops. Poop, poop, poop. Okay. Iguanodon, 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 Iguanodon. Um, we should have... Well, that's a thing. Okay, hold on. Hey, hey! UI work, please. Rest, 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 rest. Um, Ovi Raptors. A little pricey. Looks like we won't be able to get these guys quite yet. Humble social reasonable lifespan. Ten. Ten genetics for Obi Raptors. So it has to be these two. I could extract and then push her on the um, on the synthesis of the oviraptors. That might be fine. I think we will do that because we got a, the running a risk of getting backlogged here on fossils. All right, so let's do that. Uh, storm has ended. Shelter's closed. Moros right now are not really going by those other feeders, which is probably fine. Oh, that's gotta be the galley. No, that's a stego. Well, that's bad. Ah, uh, shit. Shit. Okay. Oh. That's, that's a substantial death. Trike, we don't really care about one trike dying. Everything's dying. Oh man, we're so close to five stars, and now these herbivores and shit are gonna die off on us. Shit. If the stegos are dying, what's the Alberto at for age? 6674. Really? The stegos are dead at 66? Or the age is varied. 74. Huh, the stegos are older. Hmm. Okay, um... All of our other dudes are back. So... We'll be Raptor. We put these in with the Alberto, I think. Because if they do panic, they'll have a better chance of... You're, you're fucking dying. What is our fucking ranger team doing? Alright, galleys, where do we leave off? We saw a green one. Amazon lethal baits? We didn't see that one. That one's actually pretty cool looking. I like the... Uh... I mean, the color palette's pretty garish, but I actually like the look of the stripes on the neck there. Champlain Valley, Pelophylax. Yeah, like this one, you don't see the stripes as much. Like, they're not distinctive. Distinctive. Are you really still waiting to deliver galleys? What are you, fuckers gotta take them in sets of five? Maybe. Yeah, they do. Pretty sure that's true. Right, can you get to my fucking Albertosaurus? Oh my god, dude, the die-off. No! That means it's another Stego, almost certainly. Shit. Yeah, these guys are lonely. Okay. Undiagnosed ailment. Medical team's on the way. Hypothermia. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Okay, a uh, disgruntled scientist needs to rest. Let's get those oviraptors hatched. Social, humble, large appetite. Yeah, these are all fun. If we're going to dig up more, that's going to have to wait. Um, we'll finish Iguanodon and then restock the Stegos, I guess. Shit. Asset being transported. Champlain Pilo, I think we saw that one. Asset in transit. Yeah, I guess the other ones are still just fucking snail crawling their way over there. That was almost words. Slowly moving that way. Asset delivery confirmed. I've got my hands full with the dinosaurs, so I'm leaving this next objective to you. Asset requiring collection. Yeah, we need the welfare from the egg hatch in two minutes. Or maybe that rest. That might be... No. Could be time to just grab a new person. Four... Six thirty-one. Three seventy-one. Three thirty-four. I mean, it's still not enough, but... Transporting asset. I mean, I guess the Alberto's got to get in the air and get over asset there. So there is that, too. Okay, 50 seconds on the OVs. Where's this Alberto at in the air? Oh my god. Bro. Trike. Collecting asset. Fuck. Delivery has been completed. Find scientists for eight. Do it. Okay. Ovies. Well, this is a chance to get the Ovies settled before we get the Alberto in there. need a meat feeder um guess we'll put it in the middle of the hill somewhere and uh, flatten out a little spot here so it doesn't look like it's the worst thing that's ever happened to anything well we tried we can't actually flatten out that much around it we'll put some veg it's not that bad looking This is weirder looking over here. I'm not sure why that was so crooked. Maybe there was a car there and so it wouldn't flatten out in a reasonable way. That might have been what happened. Uh, are you freshly dead? Fucking hell. No! What? I thought he had time. Seriously? Bro, what the fuck? Died of old age? That's so bad! Fuck. Assets in the air. Stop it! Setting Stop fucking dying. Test. Dude, if the Brockies die, what am I gonna fucking do? Lurg! 
76, 107. We got we got days before the Brockies are a problem. I could have sworn that Alberto had like 10 years. He almost assuredly didn't, though. Oh, the trikes are just dropping like fucking flies now, too. Alright, are the galleys all down? I think so. Uh, Mangrove Rana, that's pretty much the regular galley. Death Valley Lethal Baits, sure. We already saw you. 17, Champlain Papu. The blue and green's an interesting vibe for sure. Huh. William Blank, yeah, we went all the way back to that one. Okay, well, the galleys are there. When do the Kentros die? Oh, shit. 85, 76. So they have 10 years. We have checked. We have verified that they have 10 years. It should be fine. Um, we're not currently processing fossils or digging. Why? Because I'm dumb. Uh, we have shit. Both of these iguanodon sites to clear. Bad. Bad. Okay. Shouldn't matter. No, that shouldn't matter. Um, so large carnivores. Do we just do like Serrano? I guess we could push back to do a new Albertosaurus. Fuck it. Sure. Can we get all these corpses out of my goddamn park? Asset being transported. Honestly, at this point... I can't sell, right? They don't let you sell. Fuck's sake, bro. Oh, he's already dead. Um, we could do more Moros, but they're not really worth that much. I think I'm gonna fucking bother. Oh, these guys are really cranky right now because they have no forest or ground leaf. Um, are they gonna be really picky here? Because that might be a problem. Mm, no, that's not bad. All right, OV Raptors, what do we got? We've got. Solar Pilophylax, not bad. Gambia River Lethal Baits, that's okay. Champlain Pilo, sure. Solar Letho, sure. These all look fine. 2022, and those are the only ones down. Just the first four, huh? Freshly dead trike. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, we finished that research. Try and get the Alberto back. Number five? Wait, was it the first four? Svalbard Papu. A very dark looking OV. I like that one. That's pretty good. Cool. He's a black chicken. Mangrove Papurana. Ooh, look at your fancy tail fin. Tail, tail, tail fan. <laughs> the word. Fan, not fin. Fancy man. Fancy man. Strutting around. Should be ten of these. Asset has been transported. God, we're at four point one stars. That's that's so sad. Number eight, Quillian Blank. Uh, yeah, Blank's not gonna do it for me. Oh, just eight. Okay. Oh man, look at all these little chickens. They're all coming around to eat. Yeah. Ovi Raptors. Ovi Raptors, pretty great addition to the game. Not gonna lie. Good stuff. All right.
Well, if that's all them down, there's our fossils. Ninety-nine percent. There's no point in processing that because there'll be one more three-pip fossil here to grab. So we'll do that. That gets us iguanodon. After that, we can work on stego, I guess. Make a push for that. This is medium carnivores 4A. So there's Albertosaurus. Um, so let's take stock here at the end of this episode. 100%. 100%. Peel is dwindled to 42%. We were at 60% at one point in time. Disappointing. Um, where are we at in terms of variety? 12 species. We're missing Albertosaurus. We're getting a Guanodon. That'll get us to 14. We don't really need to get to 15. Given that we got to restock Stego and probably Trike before we're done here. Um, we'll probably not worry too much about a 15th species. If we do, it's probably just like copy, like copies in the Carno pen or something. We'll see. All right, let's end this episode here then.